Hey, it's Sharon. Today I wanted to talk to you about making a healthy lunch or dinner just using a box. Let's get started. So I don't know about you, but I don't really like to cook every night. I like to prepare my meals ahead of time. So this, these options here you can use for lunch or dinner using a box. Now these boxes you can purchase anywhere, online, in a store. They come in different sizes. They have different container compartments. Some have four, some have only three. Choose what you think will work for you, but they're great options to have in your house when you wanna prepare a meal ahead of time. So I have several items here that you can add to your box. Let's first talk, start with a protein. I've made some grilled chicken and make enough so I can make several meals for several days. I also have some hard boiled eggs and I have some shrimp. Then next I have some vegetables. You can use anything you like. I have some cut up red peppers and some carrots. I also have some marinated peppers which are great in a box lunch. Along with some grapes, you can add any other types of fruit that you like, like apples, bananas. Then next comes down to crackers. You can use different types of crackers. I'm gonna leave in the description below what I use. But some of the, my favorites are wheat thins, you have to watch the calories, or some of these other crackers that are lower in calories and lower in fat. And then finally, you need something to dip your chicken in or your vegetables or even your fruit. So how, I have here some avocado. I have some sour cream, low fat sour cream with some vegetable um, soup in it mixed in, or there's always hummus. And if you like ketchup on your chicken, make sure it's a, a low, um, no fructose ketchup. So let's get assembling our box. So again, mine only has three containers. Like you can use it with every type box you like. I'm going to take a piece of chicken first for my first box. Remember, we have plenty here to make several boxes for the week. So I'm just gonna cut it up so when it's ready to eat, it's already in bite-sized pieces, which is makes it so much easier. All right, so let's cut it up a little bit. And then we're gonna put it in our box. So I'm gonna put the chicken, which is, this is about three ounces, and three ounces is about 110 calories. So I'm gonna put it over here. But again, always measure your food. So I'm gonna put it over on this side. Then I'm gonna take some carrots. I'm gonna put it on the same side as the chicken. And I'm gonna take some of my grapes and also put them on this side. Okay, I'm gonna put my crackers in the second slot here. I'm gonna use my wheat thins today. And then I'm just gonna take my avocado. Avocado is great for dipping the carrots in and also your chicken. So this would be one meal for lunch or dinner. Again, we have several meals here and you can be creative and add some different items yourself. So like I said at the beginning, I like to prepare meals ahead of time, so I'm not cooking every night. I hope I've given you lots of options to choose from. I'll leave those options in the description below with the calorie counts. Try to keep your meals to under 300 calories. Um, be creative with your boxes, and I will see you on our next healthy eating segment.